ancient, godlike, terrifying. There are these creatures that no one has seen and they don't really even know what they look like or what they're capable of and there's sort of a lot of unanswered questions but there's a fear and a danger that's palpable. I really wanted to play with fantasy and horror, this kind of idea of figuring out what these creatures are. Try not to die. And then there's the thriller part of it which is a ticking clock and you can't leave, you're trapped forever in this place and you'll be risking your life to escape. If you step over this line, there's no turning back. The Coop's purpose is to keep these four characters safe from the Watchers. There's a big window that at night turns into a mirror, so Nina, Madeline, Kira, and Daniel can't see out, but whatever's out in the forest can see in. Everything in there has a sense of this like supernatural magnetism and also repulsion. And the Coop is very much the epitome of that, where you have to be in there to survive. Also, it's the space that you want to leave most. The characters don't know what the Watchers are, and what they want and what they're capable of. They were once something to behold and, and be in awe of, but now they're absolutely frightening. What do they do? To try to get it. What an amazing experience to be able to come sit in a theater and hear things and feel things. The scenes were built to be seen in theaters. Don't you want to know what they are? No! No!